and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm in my kitchen. Usually I wouldn't want to film in my kitchen, but everywhere else is a mess and I can't be bothered to tidy it today. And I just wanted to film this video just to get it up for tomorrow, hopefully, maybe. So I'm filming in my kitchen. If it's a bit echoey, that's why. And I can also hear the traffic noise. But if you have been subscribed for a while, and I used to film in my kitchen, I would film my happy body videos, some body shop videos, and my alarm in this room would beep every 30 seconds. We fixed that, it stopped. I knew what the issue was anyway. It was the battery. It was actually the backup battery, not the main battery, but it was beeping because of that. And we stopped it. I didn't really mind it, but when I was filming videos, it was so annoying that it was beeping all the time and I'd have to try and edit it out. And it was obviously annoying for people watching, so that's not happening anymore. But this video is gonna be, in my opinion, the top five products at the body shop, what I think are the best of the best at the body shop at the minute. My opinions always change based on new products I try or different things in my life. I don't know, my opinions always change on things. And these are just kind of like, at the minute, my top five. Everybody's opinions are different. If you have any favorites, put them in the comments, let me know. But that's what this video is gonna be. Some of them I don't have with me because I've used them up and I am gonna repurchase them, but I don't actually have them right now with me, but I will show you an image on screen of what they look like anyway. So this is just gonna be a really quick, simple video. Also, if you really like body shop products or anything like that, please subscribe because I make a literally a body shop video every single week. I've got so many of their products that it would be silly not to, so that's why I do that and lots of videos coming through autumn and winter and Christmas time. I'm gonna be posting a lot more because this is my favorite time of year. So please subscribe, but let's get on with the video. So first product is the Vitamin C Gel Moisturizer from The Body Shop. The Vitamin C range as a whole is honestly my favorite range. I only got into understanding Vitamin C as an ingredient when I started using body shop products and when I started kind of using the vitamin C range because I didn't realize how good they were or like that's the kind of thing that I like. I used to use a lot of tea tree products with spots and now I've realized that I actually prefer really glowy, like moisturized soft skin and that's what vitamin C is all about. It's all about glow, energizing your skin and just making it look basically really glowy. So I don't have that product to show because I did run out a while back and I was going to repurchase it. However, I did do a slight boots haul that I did do a vlog, I don't know, a couple of weeks back, and I purchased some things from Boots, and they accidentally added in this, which is a brightening moisture cream, and it's vitamin C, so there's no point in me buying the vitamin C moisturizer from the body shop when I've got this one. I actually think this one is a really good like comparison to the one from the body shop. This one is actually really nice, and I'm actually debating whether I would ever need to buy the one from the body shop again, because this one is really good, and it's only four pounds, and the one from the body shop is like 16 pounds or something, but I'll leave it on the screen as to what the price was. What I mainly like about that moisturizer is that it's more of a gel consistency rather than like an actual like thicker moisturizer. A lot of moisturizers are like, they're like a white color and they're kind of like a creamy, you know, consistency that's almost like a body lotion in a way. Whereas the vitamin C glow moisturizer is a gel. It just sinks into the skin so much quicker. I much prefer gel moisturizers. I'm on my own website, which I'll link in the description and making at the minute and formulating my own gel moisturizer and trying to get it right. Hopefully, fingers crossed, we can do that, but that's what I'm trying because I just love gel moisturizers so much. So that's what I'm trying. But yeah, I really love that. It is a really great hydrating, glowy product. I think for me, what I mainly liked about it is how glowy it made my skin look and how soft my skin felt. So yeah, I really like that one. I'd rate that at least a nine out of 10 maybe a 10 out of 10. So that's the first product. Product number two is also something that I can't physically show. I am gonna be repurchasing it very soon. This is the Himalayan Charcoal Face Mask. If you've never tried this mask, go and give it a try if you're into clay masks that set on the skin and then you just wash them off. So they, you know, you put them on the skin wet, they dry and then you wash them off. It's the kind of mask that makes your skin feel really tight. And I love those masks, they're my absolute favorite. It just feels like it's, you know, drawing out all the impurities in your skin. I have a similar face mask in terms of clay on my website, but mine's 
tea tree rather than like charcoal-y kind of thing so they are quite different but mine is still like a clay mask which is out of stock at the minute i am reformulating it so i don't really need to speak about that but yeah the himalayan one very good and probably one of my all-time favorite products ever because it just smells so good it makes your skin feel so good when you're using it and i just really really love it and i used to get so excited to use it and i was like oh my god i'm actually like really excited to use this product whenever i use it i'd use it like two or three times a week it is definitely more kind of aimed at like oilier skin and it would be great for you know kind of slightly spot prone to oily skin if you've got acne it might aggravate that a little bit and if you've got dry skin it might not go so well with that but overall it's a great mask i really really love it and i am going to be repurchasing it soon i'm getting my student loan soon maybe the day after this video goes up but i'm you know studying accounting and i've calculated how much money I have left over after rent, bills, food, Netflix, everything, like everything I've accounted for, I literally have nothing. So that's great. So any money I get from YouTube and sales is what I'm going to use to buy like leisure items or meals out, etc. So I'll have to wait a little bit until I buy that mask, but I cannot wait. I'm really excited. That's definitely going to be the first thing that I do buy when I have like extra money to spend and i would rate that a solid 10 out of 10 it is an absolute winner i do believe it's 18 pounds so for me it is kind of a little bit expensive for a face mask but often the body shop do do discounts and in my opinion because it's so good like in my opinion it's worth it for me and for the fact that it will mean i won't need to buy any other masks because i'm just going to be obsessed with that one so yeah that's the second product now for the third product, my third favourite from the body shop. We have a product that I can actually show you. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. This one is the Hemp Overnight Nourishing Rescue Mask. I still have this, I still use this. This is very different to the Himalayan Charcoal Mask. That one's all about like withdrawing impurities from your skin, clearing your skin and you know setting and it's really quite more of a harsh product that you would leave on for like 15 minutes, 20 minutes max. This one is a moisturizing hydrating product and i just love the packaging like first off this color is like my favorite color ever i really love it it's kind of similar to a, a product that i've got on my website which is my cleansing balm that's the kind of color that i like but yeah this is just an amazing color you get 75 ml again this is 18 pounds because it's part of their expert face masks which is what the himalayan charcoal one is also part of so they're all the same price but yeah it's 18 pounds and this is meant to be used overnight so basically when you open it this is what it looks like inside it's a green consistency on the inside and it looks and smells really nice it doesn't smell like the hand cream i know a lot of people don't like the smell of the hand cream it doesn't really smell like that but it does have kind of like a herbally smell still and i know a lot of people don't like it but i like it and also it's only a face mask you know it's all chill it's not going to put me off anything but I don't use this overnight. What you're meant to do, so just listen up here, this is what you're meant to do. You're meant to take a little bit of this product, wipe it around your face, like apply the product, with a face mask brush or anything. I sell face mask brushes on my website. And wouldn't that look cute? This is the brush that I sell on my website, just saying. But anyway, I'll stop talking now about that. But yeah, apply some onto the face and then leave it on for about 15 minutes. You then are meant to remove the excess product so anything that's like excess on your face and then go to sleep with the rest on your face just so it's not too much. I have said in previous videos that I don't really like overnight masks because it gets my pillow or the smell is strong, that kind of thing. And somebody did comment saying, this was about the tea tree overnight mask saying, oh no, it doesn't go onto your pillow. Oh no, it's not a strong smell. Like I'm not saying that that is for everybody. That's what happens with me. So it's just about me giving my experience. So that doesn't mean that I'm just saying that's what's gonna happen for everybody. But that's what you're meant to do. But what I do is I just apply a normal amount onto my skin and leave it on my skin for one hour. And then I just wash it all off. Now, the reason why I would say this is one of the best products that they've ever brought out is a because it's so so moisturizing once you take this product off instant results instantly your skin is so much softer and i'm the kind of person that's 100 percent honest when it comes to skincare makeup anything like that like i'm not going to make stuff up just for a video because why i'm going to be honest and yeah instantly my skin was so much softer it feels 
literally so 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 smooth after it i will 100 percent repurchase this because i know how good it is and i do really really like it it is part of their hemp range which is a very well trusted range in the first place the hand cream is amazing and they definitely know what they're doing when it comes to this kind of range and this specific product i really like this if you suffer with dry skin this will help you out a lot if you do have bad experiences with any of these products leave your bad experiences down in the comments this is just my opinions but i do really think that that is like one of the best products that they do in terms of hydration and a product that does actually work it's not just something you put on your skin wash it off and you're the same as you started with it does really really soften the skin and work so i'm probably going to use that tonight actually oh no i used it yesterday so i'm going to use it tomorrow maybe I do a face mask a day and i would rate that a nine out of ten number four I was gonna go like that but number four we have a product i can show you again this is the body shop vitamin c glow protect lotion with spf 30. this is also obviously part of their vitamin c range which i'm obsessed with every product in that range but i just didn't want to have this whole video be vitamin c i did do a whole video reviewing the vitamin c range it's got a few thousand views i will link it in the description if you want to go and watch that because i've tried literally every product from that range bar about one or two so i do really love this it is a sun cream and spf i use this every single morning as part of my morning skincare routine it's important even throughout winter to use spf what i particularly like about this product is that it makes my skin so glowy like when you apply it i apply it as like my last step to my skincare routine over the top of my moisturizer and when you rub it in it just rubs in so nicely like it's not like you have to really blend it it just glides into the skin it feels really soft your skin is left feeling really smooth and it looks glowy and i just think that this is just one of the best products that they have full stop and underneath makeup this is a really nice product sometimes i don't even do any skincare or do use any primer before my makeup because i will use this and that is good enough this is an amazing product and i cannot recommend this enough and i am 100 percent going to buy this in the future it's right up my street when it comes to glow and anything like that i do have a different spf that i am going to use after i finish this one but after that spf when it gets next summer probably because this has lasted me like six months this has lasted me a very long time and it's still going it's nearly run out but it's still going and i've been using it every single day but yeah i will repurchase this in the future and this is a solid 10 out of 10 product maybe apart from the himalayan charcoal mask this is definitely the next in line for the one of the best products that they actually do and i'm not sure how much that is i think it's 16 pounds but remember discounts are always on at that kind of thing so just bear that in mind final product number five is the tea tree no it's not it's the tea tree squeaky clean scrub that is amazing i don't have it to show i discussed it in my tea tree review video i reviewed the tea tree range again i will link that in the description but that is one of my all-time favorite products again it's one of those products that i used and i noticed results immediately it's not usual for that to happen when it comes to skincare products usually skincare products you have to use them for a few weeks at least for you to see a difference but that's one of the kind of products where i noticed a massive difference straight away when i first used that product i didn't have that many spots like just a few here or there i went in the shower i used the scrub it's not too harsh it's you know not gonna aggravate your spots too much unless you have really bad acne but it's not too harsh and it smells really nice and you just work it into the skin wash it off feels so refreshing your skin will feel so so nice and refreshed came out the shower looked in the mirror my skin wasn't red and usually when i use a scrub my skin gets a little bit aggravated and red but it didn't this time it looked clearer some of my spots had reduced down a lot and the next day most of my spots had gone and i was amazed and every single time i use that that is exactly what happened and i am 100 percent gonna buy that again when i've run out of my previous scrub because honestly that's one of those products that shocked me when i use a product and it actually works almost straight away i'm amazed i'm like how is this working it isn't a coincidence because i used the whole product up and every single time i used it that's what it did like it didn't i didn't use it and then no spots i used it and then saw that it was slightly clearer next day no spots so that's good i would rate that product 10 out of 10 actually 9.5 maybe because in comparison to this and the himalayan charcoal mask which is solid 10 out of 10s 
Hmm, what will I give it a 10? I'm going to give it a 9.5, but it's very good. And I'm not sure how much it costs, but I will leave the cost on the screen or maybe I already have done. So that is my five. I thought I would just throw in a bonus product, which is not a skincare product, but it's a body care product. So this is a bonus. Zesty Lemon Body Yogurt. This is kind of limited edition, which is why I didn't want to really include it in this video. But this is so nice. I think it's limited edition, correct me if I'm wrong. But this is literally the nicest smelling thing in the entire world. Like, I just love this. I might even have to get another one. And yeah, it's so nice. Their body oil gets sinking to the skin really, really nicely. And smell really good but the smell is unreal so we just wanted to include that as an extra um but yeah this is the end of the video i think overall my top tier product is the himalayan charcoal mask then it's got to be this one as a close second but apart from that that's my top five favorites i might do this video again in a few months time see if it's changed see if i've used different products or new products or they've got new products out i know they've got i think it's a new cbd range they do have their hemp range but they've got now a new cbd range so maybe i'll try a product or two from that range and i can speak about that but again like i'm saying I'm trying to save my money so i'm not going to waste it on things like that but that's it for this video if you like body shop but I'm speaking too fast. If you like body shop products, please subscribe, like this video, and I will see you in my next one. Goodbye.